이거 다 넣을까? 아빠 잠깐요 아빠 이거 재밌다 You are my champion In j i a n t s for when you stand on the feet Every battle you won I am who you say I am o u me with confidence I am seated In the heavenly place undefeated With the one who has conquered all How's it going everyone? I hope y'all are having a good day today. I'm your friendly neighborhood evangelist. Until I realized that God didn't come to condemn me. He came to save me out from my drowning, from my situation. When I was drowning in sin, when I was drowning in my mess, Jesus Christ, He pulled me out. When I lost my footing and I was just drowning in the pool of my darkness, God took me out and placed me into His light. That was 13 years ago, and now everything is so clear. I have clarity. I know where I'm going. God loved me so much that He laid down His life and took my punishment for the wrongs that I did in my life. I'm coming to you guys not with a religion. I'm offering to you guys an invitation of a love relationship with God through Jesus Christ today. If you'll accept that God came down He lived and He died on a cross for you. And He rose again from the dead to prove that He is God. You will be saved. You can have all of your past forgiven and erased. And you can literally become the righteousness of God, right standing with Him. You don't have to hold on to your guilt and your shame anymore. The blood of Jesus can wash away your past. and make you brand new. This is what God did for me 13 years ago, and that's why I'm representing Him today, because I don't know if I'm, I will ever get to see you guys again. But I take this opportunity, this moment, to share the good news that saved my life. This good news is offered to you today. An invitation is being made for you to start a love relationship with Jesus Christ. It's very easy to start a relationship. Repent. Admit that you need a Savior. Two, believe that Jesus Christ is the Son of God and He loved you that He died on a cross for you and rose again from the dead to prove that He's God. And three, get baptized. Find a Spirit-filled believer of Jesus Christ like myself. Find a body of water, even like a bathtub or a pool, and bury your old life. And when you come out of that water, God is going to give you new life that comes from Jesus Christ. And then fourthly, receive the Holy Spirit. I'm telling you guys, when the Holy Spirit comes inside of you, He will convince you that God loves you. He will illuminate your mind and open your eyes to the fact that God loves you like crazy. Woo! So receive the Holy Spirit. Repent. Believe in Jesus Christ, be baptized, and receive the Holy Spirit who Jesus has sent. And you can literally become a home for God. And God will come into your life and He will make you brand new. Right standing with God, peace with God, a peace that the world cannot give you. So if you're facing fear, anxiety, guilt and shame from your past. And what I'm speaking to you today is resonating with your heart. Pray this prayer with me. Father God, I come to you. I've messed up over and over again. But today, I turn from my sin and I turn to you. I receive your forgiveness. Thank you for washing away my past, all of my guilt and my shame. I receive you as my Lord and my Savior. I believe you are the Son of God. I believe you died on a cross for me. I believe that you rose again from the dead. I set my heart to love you today. Thank you for being my God. Thank you for making me your child. In Jesus' name I pray.
Amen. And if y'all prayed that prayer and you're feeling the peace and the presence of God, that's it. That's called the born again experience. And if you don't trust them, examine the resurrection and see if what I'm saying is true. See if Jesus Christ really is God or not. Because if he isn't God, then what I'm sharing to you today is of no importance. But if Jesus is God, then it is of the greatest importance. Love you guys. Y'all have an amazing day today. God bless.